Hi, this is Shane, and welcome to another episode of Automatum. So, um, I've been having a look at how to make a golem, and they're pretty easy. I just need four blocks of iron and a pumpkin. So, I think what I will do, I went and put down the pulvis, and it's working. It's all doubling, which is awesome. Um, I put in the speed up, not the speed, efficiency upgrade which we can get done and also I need to make the input output what the, oh there it is it's also got the efficiency upgrade yeah so while that um, iron is cooking up because I need iron I need um, a piston and I need a hopper So while that is going, I will go downstairs, get the pistons, because they've got pistons. I don't know why this thing does not like me, because we don't need chairs and stuff inside. Oh, and a lever. Um, gravel. Yeah, we don't need pistons. We can just have chairs. And did I need? I think there's one furnace in there. I think I need one piston though. But I need a hopper. So I can make... At least I can make the hopper from this at one two three four five hopper pipe okay and the chest in the middle that makes a hopper um input output and that gives me two so then i can specify input not input output I don't want all right to the right front no right enabled auto and then with this one input not from the top but from the left yes so it will take whatever's in the furnace and put it straight put whatever's in the f in the pulvis and put it straight into the furnace yes and then this if i move this table and then let's make let's put down where are we going to put the table oh there was a pressure plate here Let's put the table on the other side. Oh, this is this blew up in the with the thing, the creeper. Um, do I have any? No, I don't have any of that. I want to put down the table here on the other side of the door, and I want to make. Some chests. Okay, so that's four chests. So if I put um, a double chest on this side, and then I can say that I want it to output not to the bottom but to the right and it should put it all into the chest there you go so that's that so we need to do this one seeds carrots and potatoes potatoes it's seen so you want carrots and seeds that should be pretty easy because we're in a village hold on let's put away some stuff 
let's be tidy. The iron goes in this chest. Certus quartz dust, I don't know. I can't remember what that makes. But we'll leave that for now. Any other thing to smelt up? No. Put those in there, that goes in there. Put that in there, and the gravel. Okay, let's go see if we can find some seeds. You did shut, so did that mean somebody went in after I left? Okay, those, that's rice. No, we don't want potatoes. We've already found potatoes. It wants carrots and it wants grass seeds. Which is over here. These are rice seeds. These are seed seeds. So let's see. I hope you guys don't mind me filching your seeds. That's five seeds. I know these are potatoes. You want carrots. Yeah, sorry buddy. These are carrots, these are carrots. Oh, you just picked up all the carrots. Is that what it is, huh? Okay. So you picked up all the carrots. Up here. Um, there's a rice seed. Again with the rice seeds, potatoes. Oh, I thought I went and jumped on it. Rice seeds, there's a cow. Somebody's got a cow. Well, I guess if you've got a village that's been plagued by things, you might as well keep your cow on top of your house. Keep it safe. These are potatoes. And these are all normal seeds. Okay, we've, we missed one. Yes, we did. How many seeds do we have? Ten. Is that it? Is that really it? Okay. Let's go home. Let's sleep. Until we pound up some... Where's our house? Over here. Until we get enough to make a golem. And then we can... And then we can move around as we want. Now we need to go upstairs. And be awake as we want. Fifty-five, that's enough to make our four blocks of iron. One, two, three, four. And also, we need a pumpkin. Alright, let's go and sleep and then we'll make the golem. I mean, I know that seems a bit counterintuitive. Counter you should make it during the day. But I, want to, I mean, at night, so then it can kill off stuff. But I actually want to see what I'm doing. So, we'll sleep, which we've done. And then let's go make a golem and go save our village. Because I kind of like this village. It's a bit derpy. And these guys seem to want to survive. So let's put you, Mr. Golem, in the middle of the village. We might have to make another golem at some point. And I'm really going to have to put some stairs around here. because it's really hard to get around. Alright, where should we put you? Alright, this is where we usually come up. And I don't know how golems are with stairs and stuff. 
All right, so we need one, two, three, four, and pumpkin head. Woo, we did it. And he's off. He's all right with stairs, actually, but bits of... Yeah, he's off. Yeah, I think we're going to have to make another one at some point. But right now we're good. I think we are good. Let's see if we can find these all potatoes. Even though I waypointed those villages, I should have... Um, put in, I should have put in, no, not waypointed, we activated the waystone, but I should have put in waypoints in them. Let's have a look at our journey map. So here's home. I think this is Rialkart Cart Hills, and that's the one we were trying to get to in the last episode. So yeah, so let me go to these villages, see if I can find some carrots, and then I'll be back. Well, look what I found. I found the other village. Actually, it was literally when I was going up the the mountain in the last episode, and I looked across and I saw a village. If I'd kept going, I would have found this village. So they're literally just across the way from each other. They um, uh, The journey map makes it look a lot further. But they're not that far apart and this is in extreme hills which is awesome so we can probably go oh we need seeds don't we we need carrots and we need seeds but um but yeah so i could probably go looking for emeralds in this biome if we wanted to any of these that are fully Fully grown, that one is. Okay, we've got 19 seeds. Let's activate this waystone. Merzakur Plains. Okay. And let's put in a, a waypoint inside of a house, as opposed to in the middle of the village. There's only 500 blocks from our home village, which is good. Oh, this has an... Oh, look at that. This has... This, this place is way nicer than what we have. And they've got plenty of food. We need to raid this village. Um, Merzaka Village. See, my, my caps is, um, I put my caps is locked to a, to one of the, I think it's to my book. I can't speak now. I can't think of what I was going to say. My caps lock key is keyed to the quest book because home was keyed to something else, which is what I usually put my quest book on. Was that pie? Oh, four carrots. That's what we need. And pumpkin pie. There you go. So what do we want? Pumpkin pe the uh, pumpkin seeds or melon seeds? We'll take melon because we haven't found those yet. Found pumpkins. Okay. The iron chest we haven't done. We need to make a watering can. And anything else? That's a choice reward. I think I would take... Yeah, I don't know if I want the growth crystal because... Yeah, I don't know. We need to do the better chest. Chisel. You need to just make two chisels. And you can get a diamond chisel. Well, one is from the Chisel and Bits mod. And this one, I'm, I'm not sure which mod. 
that is from, but we'll choose the chisel and bits chisel because, you know, I'm not much for decorating and stuff, but, you know, at least it looks awesome. It looks like it's getting dark. Let's find a bed in this joint. Wow, they, this, this has to be a town. Because, you know, they're way fancy. Way fancy er. 21, that's bait. Let's see what else we can find. I should have gone on the other side and see what they have. Wow. Uh, bread, book and quill, wooden sword. We don't need a wooden sword. Uh, more carrots and fish. We can get rid of the dirt, take the fish. Our two levers, that's what that was. And what's upstairs? Oh, more bedrooms. No, I didn't want a new spawn point. Leather pants. Okay, we've got to see what we want to leave. I don't know if I want to leave anything. What's my armor like? My armor's pretty okay, actually. Looking at the stats. More carrots, more fish. Carrots, fish, and some leather pants. We can leave the leather pants. Actually, what I want to try and get is um, some obsidian armor. Because that's pretty easy to make. We looked in this, didn't we? I wanted to see if there was a blacksmith. That's what I wanted. Um, let's go this way. And then we can go home and make the watering can. Why is the dirt... is that... The dirt's two different colours, but that might just be... What is that? Is that like the jail? I've, I've never seen a stone house. This is the big wooden house that always generates in Minecraft villages, but it's in stone rather than... And what's this? Is this another one? Yeah, it's another one. The big stone house, but a big the big wooden house, sorry, but it's generated in stone. It's pretty cool that they've had some houses that generate in stone rather than in um rather than in wood. Alright, so where is the blacksmiths? There has to be a blacksmith, because this is quite a big town. We've activated the waypoint. There's the blacksmiths. Did we go in the blacksmiths? I can't... I thought, I thought that was a creeper we went flying past. I can't remember. No, we haven't. Iron chest plate. Iron helmet. Apple and bread. And treated sticks. Treated sticks is also very good. Alright, we can eat the blackberries. It's not enough to to get rid of them. What can we leave? Certus quartz hoe, though. Well, that's very nice. Um, the sugar cane. And the feathers. And the stone pickaxe, because that's pretty much knackered. Take treated sticks. Well, guys, it was nice knowing you. What's in here? Oh, this is a library. It was nice knowing you. Would you like me to put something in front of the door so that you can get up there, Mr. Librarian? I don't know. Let's put... Some dirt in front of the door just for you, Mr. Librarian. 
There you go. You can't say I didn't do anything nice for you. And now that we're here, you can just about see the other village right there between those two trees, so it's it's pretty close. What's this over here? Oh, more overworld, overland stuff. So the villages are really close, within walking distance. It's probably the suburbs to that one. Um, okay, they've got a huge windmill, which is really cool. I do love the windmill. I'd love to know which mod puts in these fancy houses. Because look, this is the big this is the big house. This is how it usually looks. But in the other in the other village it's spawn it spawned in a stone, which is pretty cool. Did we find this village? I can't remember. There's the blacksmith. We'll know if the blacksmith's chest has been No it hasn't. Ooh, Electrum. Bread, apple, gold. Oh man, um, hmm. Hmm. Okay, there's a furnace out here. If we put the chicken in the furnace and we find some wood, right, can I borrow this piece of wood, please? You know, I'll bring it back at some point you don't you're not gonna miss it and put that in that should cook the chicken so that will free up a slot hurry up and, oh I thought I wasn't going to be enough right so that should free up a slot Gold and electron. Well, let's take the apple. Hmm. Actually, what I could do is just leave it and then hopefully remember to to come back for it. All right, where's the waypoint? Did we find? No, we didn't come to this village. This is a different village because this has a church. This has a church, so is this a different village? A different town, village, whatever. Ooh, that, I wonder if that osmium was put there on purpose. Ink sacks. There's a book. And then this goes up to the top, I believe. Oh, more, more chests, but nothing in them. Do we want to live in a church? <gasps> it's the enchanting table. There is an enchanting table in the church. Which is probably how it should be, to be honest. I mean, every church needs an enchanting table. And then this goes... Where is it? Oh, up to the spire at the top. Okay, so the meteor home is that way. The other village is that way. Yeah. I think there's probably the same village. There's the waystone right there. Let's go and see if this is the same. I think I think this is the same one. But I have to admit with this resource pack it makes the glass look absolutely amazing so it makes this church look even more church like and then these a can oh it's a candle i thought these were redstone torches they're candles and a weighted pressure pressure plate oh somebody knocked this down I wonder what knocked down the torches. That's interesting. It's 
Suddenly knocked down the torches. Alright, so... Oak leaves. That is a very pretty... I want... I really would... I'd love to know which mod puts in these buildings. Um, you know what? I should have looked to see which direction. That would have made sense. But I think it's this way. Um, the sun's going down. No, we haven't been to this village. So which one's this one then? Z Z Zoy Zoramed Plains. All right, let's. Well, they're all running to a house. All right, let's waypoint. Uh, I can't spell that. Z. Zoe Med Plains. Save. And then we can teleport home and sleep. I really should change my teleportation where I teleport to. I'll put it next to my bed rather than downstairs in the building. So where did we find an extra? Did we find an extra? Oh, we did find an extra village. Okay, so this is where we wanted to go. This is an extra one. And it's this one that we went to. Because this has the meteor. So that's where I want to go and waypoint it and then come back. Alright, well then I will quickly do that and come back. Right, so I went to the village and um, then I came home but I did a bit of mining. Because I found a iron pickaxe in one of the villages. So I went and picked up some of the diamonds that were down in the basement. And with that, I can make an addition as additional slot for the furnace and the pulvis. So to make... Let's see, XP upgrade is what? Oh, that needs slime, which I don't have. And glowstone dust. Although glowstone dust we can get. And that needs blaze rods. But no, the slot upgrade just needs two diamonds. What was the heart-shaped heart diamond? Oh. But you need two diamonds and iron, which I have. So to make for one of each, two diamonds, two iron, two slot upgrades. As simple as that. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, so each, each slot upgrade will give you an additional s slot. And then that gives you two maximum. Which is quite cool. Split items even. Yes. Oh, that is cool. Alright. Um, what else did I want to smelt up? The copper. The lead ore will leave for now. Copper. There's more iron. Actually, I think we can make another slot upgrade. So, we need one more iron. So you can make two more. One, two, one, two. And two iron. That's two upgrades. One, four. Here? Oh. Is it because it's working, maybe? Okay. And then we can put the iron in there as well and split them all even. That is, that is marvelous. Right, we don't want to split it even because then we can get stuff coming in from 
the other furnace. There's what copper, there's iron, there's copper. So I guess all the copper. I guess we could split it even then. And then it will just do the copper, distribute the copper, and then when that's finished it will distribute that. That is that is marvellous actually. Why have I never heard about this mod? It's a pretty cool mod. So, that's it for this episode. Please like, comment and subscribe for more great content. It will help to grow my channel. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.